Hi, my name is Emily Mullet, and I'm a huge fan of classic films. If you've never had the opportunity to watch an old movie before, you are really missing out. Some of the greatest films ever made were from the 1930s and 40s, and once you're hooked, you'll be a fan forever. There's nothing like curling up on your sofa and being whisked away to another time and into a great story. Tonight, I've chosen a romantic comedy that can be appreciated by movie fans of all ages. It's about a beautiful girl, played by Ginger Rogers, who wants to get home to Iowa on a train. Problem is, she can only afford a ticket at half fare, so she poses as a minor. While on the train, she meets a major, played by Ray Milland. He, believing her to be a child, takes her under his wing and back to a military academy with swooning, love-thirsty cadets. But this brunette bombshell only has eyes for her major. This was the directorial debut of the great Billy Wilder and also has a cameo appearance by Roger's own mother, Leela Rogers, who was directing at RKO Pictures at the time. It's no wonder that Ginger Rogers said out of all the movies she ever made, this was one of her favorites. So why don't you slip out of that wet coat and into a dry martini? And enjoy this wonderful film, the film that captured my heart and started my lifelong love affair with old movies. From 1942, The Major and the Minor. 